Hey guys, what's going on? It's me. It's Roger. Happy Hippie. I'm back. Kind of a different angle. I'm standing up tonight. Kind of like uh, Vinyl Richie. This is a uh, part two video. Uh, about a week or so ago, I did 10 perfect albums that I felt were perfect. The last few days, I've been getting together another 10. What well, a night I was watching a video by Vinyl's Spins. Uh, Vinyl Spins with a Z. Vinyl Spins is a great channel. He was doing his 10 perfect. And that just gave me the motivation to get off my butt and make this part two video. And this is just my opinion. It's all, it's based on what I like. You know, feel free to agree or disagree. 10 perfect albums. Go back to the 90s. Pearl Jam. I remember it well coming out. Had it on cassette. Had an old station wagon. And I remember just playing the hell out of this cassette. Pearl Jam. In my opinion, one of the perfect ones. From the 1980s. The Beastie Boys. Eat Me. Now that wasn't the name of the album, but... As teenagers, we sat around and laughed about that. When Beastie Boys, man, holy moly, dude. I don't care what party you went to. At some time during the night, I'm talking keg parties, high school, post-high school stuff, you know, young people. What party you went to, somebody put this album on. I don't care if there were a bunch of metalheads, a bunch of punk rockers or whatever, dude. The Beastie Boys... In my opinion, that's a near-perfect album. Now, in my last video, I did not show any Hendrix or Dead or The Stones. And I did that on purpose, because I'm saving them. But tonight, I am showing Jimi Hendrix. It's a wonderful, wonderful album. You never want to pick up the needle. You never want to fast-forward the CD. Hendrix. Spins Vinyl showed another Hendrix album, but I'm leaning with that one. Another perfect album, in my opinion, is the band Love. And this is Forever Changes. Um, Arthur Lee, uh, lead singer of this band, man, really good vocalist. Lived kind of a troubled life. Uh, they put out a couple great albums, though. Um... Fantastic album. If you don't know this album, change that. One album that Spins Vinyl showed was uh, Pet Sounds. And I was planning on showing it too. But I've got this one to show. This is the only copy I have on LP. It looks like a back of an album. Because it is. This is the uh, double record set. One album is Pet Sounds. And the other album is, uh, my mind is completely Carl and the Passions. So, Pet Sounds. Put on a CD. Put on the tape, the album, whatever. You will not get up and change it. A perfect flipping album. Another album to me that is perfect. Prince's 1999. This is a Walmart copy. I had this on cassette when it first came out. You don't care about that, though. I get it. 1999. It was just, it was just a badass album. Was it rock? Was it soul? I mean, it's just everybody loved this album. Bitches Brew. This is the album that got me into jazz. I was working at WDVX as their music director, working part time at the Disc Exchange on Chapman Highway in Knoxville, Tennessee. If anyone familiar with Knoxville remembers that really cool CD store. Anyway, I was about 30-ish. I always wanted to really get into jazz, and this older dude, I remember he had a long ponytail. Because if you like rock and roll, start with Bitches Brew. And I remember we could borrow, you know, the UCDs from the store. I remember borrowing it, bringing it back, and buying it. I loved it. Bitches Brew. Fantastic, fantastic album. And if you're into rock and roll, hard rock, 
and you're thinking about jazz, that's a good album to start with. Another perfect album. Led Zeppelin 2. This is just a, a reissue. Fantastic album from opening cut to the last track on the album. Perfect album. Winding it down, guys. Suicidal Tendencies. Fantastic album, dude. It was thrash. It was hard rock. It was punk. It was only getting played on the punk stations or the college stations. WHFS up in D.C. played the hell out of it. Suicidal Tendencies. Early thrash, early punk. And it's, it's, it's a great album. It's perfect. And last but not least, this time I had to show some Grateful Dead. I'm going with American Beauty. One of their perfect albums they made. This is on this beautiful kind of red vinyl. Grateful Dead, American Beauty. It's another 10 perfect albums. I'd love to see yours or even in the comments. You know, blast me out. Tell me I'm crazy, you know. Tell me your favorite. Peace, guys. I hope everyone's doing all right.